press OK. And it says welcome to the VLC application guide. Select your application. In this case, the default application is compressor. So that's OK. We will leave that. Your motor voltage. I'll just program 414 volts. That's OK. Use the arrows to move down. 1 and 414. Press OK and you move down. The motor frequency was 90 Hz. The motor current was 11. The nominal motor speed was 5,290. Arrow down. And the minimum frequency was 35. Press OK to that. We go down to the maximum frequency, which is supposed to be 90. Does the application include a bypass valve? In this case, no, but you can also choose yes. Then we are asked, do we want to use internal or external control? We would like to use the built-in PID control. So based on the inputs we get from the pressure transmitters we saw previously, we will regulate. The sensor type is pressure transmitters and we are using bars. Arrow down. And in this case, it's the low pressure part of the system, so it's minus 1 to 12 and our control or the sensor signal is 1 to 5 volts. Now the drive tells you how you should connect your 1 to 5 volt signal from your pressure transmitter. So now we can select our unit for our set point. So we can choose either degree Celsius or Fahrenheit. We will choose degree Celsius. And now we must also select the refrigerant, so the drive will know which pressure corresponds to which, which temperature. To. In this case, the refrigerant is 404A. The refrigeration drive has up to 30 built-in refrigerants. Press arrow down. And we are asked, do we want to use a fixed or a floating set point? We'll go for the fixed set point. And we will into the set point. In this case I will go for minus 5. OK with that. We'll move down. Then we are asked for the high and low set point limits. And these are the boundary conditions in which we can operate. So I will leave them alone. Now we are asked to enter the cut out value. I'll put this at minus 10. The refrigeration uh, experts will usually know these values of which the system is designed to. The cut-in value is zero degrees in this case and I will leave that as well. Then in this case we do have two compressors in the system. This is what pack control means, that you can control up to three compressors and you now ask do you have more than one compressor or do you wish to configure pack control? We'll say yes to that. Okay arrow down. How many compressors do we have? We have one variable speed and one fixed speed. So two compressors it is. Now it, the drive tells you where should I connect my fixed speed compressor. I press OK. We have now set up the compressor. So arrow down and now you can choose between rerun the wizard, go to main menu. This is what we'll do and I will hit status 